Well, that's all the say you and Senior Venegas here. Uh, I just want to give you a quick little video about how to access a few things on our blog. I thought it was pretty clear before, but I've been getting a few emails about how they haven't been able to kind of find things. So I just thought I'd send like a quick little one minute reminder about like where to like type things in and where to kind of click and how to access all this stuff because it's pretty, it's pretty laid out for you. Uh, it's always kind of constantly changing, but the main format is kind of like the same. So hopefully uh, this kind of, this helps. So. Go. All right, so the first thing you're going to do here is you're going to go to the address bar and you're going to type in www.michaelvenegascssd.wordpress.com and press enter. And then the blog will pop up there. So right away on the main page of the blog, you're going to see what the students write every day in their agendas. Immediately under that, you're going to see academics at a glance is the things that we are specifically doing. Then important dates of days of things that we're going to be doing. And right under there at the very bottom are the quick links, such as Mathematics and Raz Kids. If you go to the very top, you're going to have some quick links. If you hit the Google Docs links tab and give it a moment to refresh, then you'll be able to scroll down and you can see all the documents that we have there. I've done my best to scan as many of the things that we're going to be working with in school and putting them on there, such as if you go to the building spelling skills, all the spelling words for the entire year are right there. So if you just follow with the calendar, you'll know exactly where, where we're at. Right under there, you can have access to all the paperwork that we're working with, the Daily Five. So you'll have our word work, our grammar rules that we'll have a kind of like a little test on in a few weeks. Scroll down, you'll hit all of our math. There is a tab for our math tests. They do kind of look like workbooks, but they're more like a test bank, what I'll base all of our tests off of. Right above it, there is a tab for all the workbooks that we are working with in class that are directly linked up with the digital mathematics program that we do. If you hit calendars, you'll see the calendars and the six-day class schedule that we have. So we have September, October, and November there. And if you hit vlogs, you'll see videos such as this one that I'll post on there. So yeah, there you go. So I hope that helped out. I hope that was good. Uh, but as always, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to email me, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Gracias.